We're doing the tr uh, triple region map randomizer. Pokemon moves, items, and abilities are fully randomized. Also, all of the doors, teleports, and warps also fully randomized. Uh, we're using three games today. They are all interconnected with each other. Uh, and the goal is to oops, get all 24 badges, beat all of the E12, beat the three champions, and then the final boss that is hiding in Meteor Falls. Oh, a ball. Early ball. No, 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 pockets. Don't add it to. Don't add it to seven TV. Let I, I'm actually considering adding it to the main emotes. There on Shroomish. Okay, out of the three, which one's the fastest? Laron, Shroomish, or Sfield? No idea. Smelling salt. Oh my god, so weak. No. I didn't consent to this. But yeah, the map randomizer is starting soon, chat. I just have to get through this fight. And then uh, we're, we're going straight to Johto, maybe? Maybe Hoenn? Maybe we'll stay in Kanto? I don't know. We'll see where the wind takes us, brother. Convenient Oaks Parcel uh, code change. Love it. And the bolts. And we're free. Well. Right through me. I did not change the settings. I should have done that. Offset. We're free. PB's on screen. Co-op PB's on screen too. Uh, I mean, I, I would like to beat the solo PB today, of course. Need, needs a good seat. Needs some good gameplay. Good decision making. Maybe I can aim to even beat the time I got with small end. Which I don't remember. It was like 5.30 something. Alright, and we're in. Instantly losing all my money to Team Rocket. Great. Can we find a mega early good main? Oh. Okay. That was super laggy <laughs> for a second. <laughs> oh, okay. Early Jasmine. 
That's always nice. It looks like the abandoned ship and the uh, where we just came from are very, very well connected. Ho and V Road. I want to catch something here. Caterpie. I have to. Just for repelling. Brings me back, man. We gotta do the Caterpie and Beedrill, or Butterfree and Beedrill only challenge. Ooh, it has Dig. Nice. Good catch. Never needed it. What is this? Escape rope. Ten F. We're looking for Cerulean Cave or like a level seventy. Oh, do we have the seventy prediction? Is that the one that's on right now? Nice. Oh, is the blue flute the 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 sleep flute? Because that that would translate to the uh, the poker flute. Oh, money, nice. Floor two. But I didn't get the key because I only had a Caterpie. Oh! <gasps> Sub 10 minute? Rayquaza. Rayquaza wins. And it's a good Pokemon too. Dude, let's go. Welcome to the crew. Chris Paul. Thank you, Scathely. Magma armor. Higher special attack than attack on this Blaziken. Is that because of bolt nature or? This is not doable. Yeah. Who do I curse now? <laughs> you could go for it. You could do the same prediction again, but without Rayquaza if you want to. Have another prediction running. What was the moveset? Bubble Beam. That's pretty much the whole moveset.
Oh, right, there's the cutscene. I think it's weird that Kitty changed it, that you that Rayquaza stays. Feels a little easy mode on the Ray part, you know? I played mad. Good timing, honestly, during the cutscene. We should be on the water now. Oh, I need to be clicked in. I guess I'll save here and then maybe just pick up Waterfall and see where the middle leads to. I don't know if I want to teach it though. Probably rather wait for Surf. Freedom? Oh! Straight to Rock Smash? What's going on? I don't have any repels. She's sweet but psycho. Think of the prime. New primer. Let me in! Floor four. Should probably go get the key so I can move freely around Sylph. Welcome to the crew. I don't know if I have the Poke Flute or not. Awaken sleeping Pokemon. Yeah, that gave us the Poke Flute. Because we found a random blue flute. It's not very effective that you also have the prime. A marathon on all the Emerald Rogue runs, hell yeah. Thank you. More to come. Welcome to the crew. Thank you, MG, for the prime. Hype train. How many primers? I need TMs. Flamethrower. Oh, Giga Train's not bad. Wear a hat? I'm wearing it. What do you mean? I saw a tweet about London having amazing beans. No, they're not amazing beans. It's just beans. Beans for breakfast. Beans are nice. I don't have repels. Ah! Beans? Beans. I do have the card key. Let's do it. 
I just picked it up. Wait, what? Did the Master Ball just actually randomize into a Master Ball? I can't be Glacier. First E4 discovered. How about we find a Mart so I can buy some Repels? Rayquaza won the prediction. You can Gumba again. There's another Gumba open. Don't miss your chance. Glitch. Who designed this place? Why is it a thing? It's not even a maze. What is it supposed to be? I never pass. Everything is random. Doo -doo -doo. We're trying to find all badges, beat all E4, all champions. There's multiple. Today's li a little bit of a struggle chat. I had to get up early this morning. Took a train from uh, London, back home. Wait, why are you sad? It's fine. Just a little, just a little sleepy. Cerulean cave. That's a really good one to find because it's it's really annoying to to check that one from the other side. Uh, actually, I'll keep on here. You stepped in there and your your dog woke you up by climbing on you. That's what they do. Feed me. When are we finding the first big one? That's one of the champions. Yeah, I was uh, I was in England today, and in France, and in Belgium, and in the Netherlands. Crazy day, I know. And now I'm streaming. <laughs> uh, I can't buy repels here, can I? Thank you, Kecleon. Max repels. Worth. Welcome to the crew. PB today on randomizer. Maybe.
Magic hands, thank you very much. I hope so, I hope so. Okay, there's encounters here, so I'm going to... Repel. Cleanse tag's pretty good, too. I still, by the way, only have Bubble Beam. If we encounter a Pokemon with Water Absorb, we have a problem. <laughs> I mean, we should probably commit to Blaziken. It's very unlikely we'll find something better. I can just teach Giga Drain. And then we can at least hit everything. What are you teaching? Recycle. Yeah, that's awesome. So good, dude. Oh, that was a tea house. No. Johto is a rum hack called Pokemon Crystal Dust. So it turns Gen 2 into Gen 3 game. It's very nice. Give me that. Also, excited. Welcome to the crew. No. no. Lucky number 13, Chris. Wow. Wow. Thank you, Kristen. I will. Have you ever had one of these doors lead to its intended area? Uh, yeah, it happens every now and then. Like the, the one in 800 or something chance happens. It's actually less than, like, it's worse odds than 1 in 800. But it does happen every now and then. Okay, what's the first gym we're finding? Best case scenario, Surge, I think. Surge would be best case. Another Poker Flute. Fly badge, maybe that would be nice. Getting flies really easy in this game. Also, new new tutor, punch punch punch. Needle arm. That's kind of punch.
Another champion? I found two champions before I found one gym leader. You know what? I'll try. Bubble beam needle arm only. Uh, classic AG. According to Iron Fist, needle arm is not a punching move. We got Bla we got blazing at level uh, at eight minutes in. There's the Rayquaza. And it, it has higher special attack than attack, and it's it's bold nature. But I thought bold was special attack down and defense up. Oh, Bolt is attack down, defense up. Oh, okay. That makes sense. One E four dead. Still no gym leader though. And no big mart found yet. I want to check for some good TMs. Feel like uh, going up cycling road. Let's just turn around and pretend we never found it. That's a real strat you can do. I mean, this should be about the same level as the gym we just, uh, the E4 we just did. Oh man, but I, now I'm committed. I can't turn around. I have to do this. Do I have any TMs? Yeah, oh, I picked up um, Giga Drain, which is charm in this game. Hmm. Well. They are guaranteed. Mamba. What's my favorite Hoenn city? Favorite Hoenn city. Mm, Fortree? Oh god. That's so bad. I'm actually gonna poison powder that. 
Oh, I'm dead. Double poison powder miss. Sorry, right, just die. Wiping's better than trying to force this win. Dude, stab Fury Cutter on Caterpie would have been so good. <laughs> okay, I'm in Slateport now. That was a teleport strat. Terra Cave. I'm still checking. I'm probably gonna catch it. Groudon wins the prediction. Ding dong. Ding dong. Goldeen. Oh, Butterfree. The other ding dong. But a free special attack is really low. I think it's 80. So we'll, we'll keep maining the Blaziken. What do you got? Rolling kick. That is good. Roll out turned into rolling kick. No, back to Blissey. Ah, uh, if I'm in the area, I'll do it. I don't think we have to rush that. It only unlocks, uh... Waterfall. Oh, it's a ruin cave? It's the Mewtwo floor? Oh man, Mewtwo? Was so shortly after the Groudon. Sorry, Team Mewtwo. Found the final boss. Dude, we're discovering this entire room so quickly. Welcome to the crew. What the hell? 
Hi Chris, did you know that the world record for flipping beer mats with one hand is held by a guy called Matt Hand? Didn't know that. Thank you, Ignis. Arjun badges and HMs not randomized with overworld drops. No, 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 no. This is just a map randomizer. It's a lot more simple than the other stuff we've done recently. Yeah? What is this? Ah, this is a Shucky guy. I'll do more of the Archipelago stuff soon. I'm actually very excited for it. Looking forward. Tutors. Facade and Sludge. I'll take Facade. Chris got back early. No, no, no. I, I got. I was supposed to go back today. I just wasn't sure if I was going to stream today because today was travel day and I'm quite tired. But you know, doing the stream anyway. It's not all that far in NL. What do you mean? I was in the UK earlier. Karen. I, I played Mario Wonder at EGX. Yeah, it was fun. It felt pretty good. I don't make much ad revenue of streaming. That's not what it is about. I'm gonna buy Wonder soon, tomorrow maybe, and pre pre download. Should I? Oh, what do you think, Chad? Should I um, go to Australia to play Wonder a day early? Welcome to the crew. Uh, Skataya, thank you for the prime. I'd say it's worth. It's probably worth. see that. Uh, 
I don't have X items. How have I still not found one of the big mards? There's three of them. Any plans on playing the new Detective Pikachu game? Dude, probably not. If if I was going to play it, I would have already done it. Like day one. Oh, there it is. Floor five. Rustboro City. Heel pad floor. I was watching like five minutes of it. I think when Fiend was playing. And the game, it looked awful. <laughs> it looked really bad. I just saved, so I'm just gonna reset. Oops, hold on. Looks better than Scarlet Violet. Oh, I mean, yeah. It, I don't know, it looks like... It looks bad, which doesn't mean much, right? It could still be very fun. But from what I've gathered, it, it does look like it is... A kid's game. Like, as in... Not so much enjoyable... For... Older... Gamers. I don't know if, that, I don't know if that's accurate or not. Like regular Pokemon games are still fun for anyone. But if it's like if it's a tailored to kids game, then you know, it loses a little bit of its appeal. Like the difference between like Dora and SpongeBob, for example. Right? Spongebob is still enjoyable for, like, any age. Dora, not so much. It's three stitched together, Panicky. It's a custom program that uh, links them. It's really nice. So you're not going to play Mario RPG? Wait, what? 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 what, what? Can you uh, tell me where you got that from? Same game. Bum, bum, bum. 
Floor six. Uh, items. I'll pick them up. Money. What's going on? Seven. Thank you for the prime. Back in civilian. Mario RPG. Kids are not going to enjoy Mario RPG. I don't think so. They would have to change the game, like, severely. It's too complicated. I wouldn't say any Mario game is is a made is a kids game the way I define kids games. So, something like Mario teaches typing, maybe. And when it comes to Pokemon games, like I would say Channel Pokemon Channel is definitely one of them. Then again, though, I never played Pokemon Channel. But I've, I've heard the concept. Lucky you, what do you mean? That's surf. I don't want to beat the kimono girls though. Do, 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 do. I am stuck here. Ah, oh, this is exactly the same region. That's a soft block, but we have the warp feature. Warp feature is kind of annoying. Because we're back in pallet. It's kind of a punishment. Gotta walk back up. What's going on? Uh, Youper, thank you very much for the prime. 
Back in Gen 3, I think the only way you could get Jirachi was with Pokemon Channel. Now there is different ways. Look at the panel. Coliseum also. Oh, does Coliseum have a disc for it too? to floor three. I am a little concerned, Chet. We've gone through almost 300 warps, 250 warps, and we found one gym. That's a little worrying, I would say. Wait, that's working. Well. Did I beat Karen? I did. I think I beat Karen. Ah, oh, let's go. Yeah, sometimes complaining just helps. Maybe this is the gym city? Yo, maybe. Going to be spent with Minecraft tweets today, but why? Yo, chat. Tom we have. Okay, here's how the next few days are gonna look like. Tomorrow, Mario Monday of some sort. Probably, I'm probably gonna continue the Kaizo Sunshine. Uh, all day tomorrow. And then Tuesday, I'm gonna do another tri uh, triple game speedrun. Archipelago. Because I'm addicted. And on Wednesday we're playing Rogue. Uh partially with Bloody. We're doing we're doing more rogue races with Bloody. And then Thursday, Super Mario Bros. Wonder comes out. I got, I got, I got plans. Archie Pelagio. Wait. 
We're checking for TMs and X items. Uh, I don't need any of this. Maybe one more X defend. X oh, oh, that's bad. <laughs> Wait, there was a card spec. Lepa berries. Nice. Uh, no, no, no. Hmm, these moves are all ass. And the... The Johto ones were bad, too. We still have the Salad on March for TMs. Oh, they might be good TMs in other regions, though. That's true. I would have to buy them, though. We got we got a TM from Whitney. Weather Ball. Weather Ball and Hoenn. Well, now we're in Johto. Let's have a look. Blaze Kick. Yeah, let's do it. Double step. Blaze kick Blaziken. What a terrible signature move. Nice, Brian. Hope you're having a chill day on this Sunday. I saw a tweet earlier today that said... Uh, content creation... Is a harder job than 99% of jobs. And the comments on that post were really angry. Like, I think the point they were trying to make is that being a creator is a lot harder than it seems, which I agree with. But being one of the hardest jobs, I don't know about that, man. <laughs> I don't know about that. Twitter, I, I, it took me a long time to notice the changes on Twitter, like the, the, 
like the back code changes that Elon implemented to to Twitter. But it it is it is actually getting a lot worse. Twitter hasn't always been this bad. It's it's really unfortunate. It's it's actually becoming less and less enjoyable. It's so unfortunate. I'm sure whatever he's working on, like Elon makes really quick changes and just sees what happens. Like there isn't, and there isn't much testing beforehand. He just does it and see if it works or not, which is, you know, the Elon way. And he sees number go up. I can't go through. He sees number go up. And it and that tells him it's working, and it probably is. But it also means that the quality of the website's going to shit. It's it's like more and more going the direction of Facebook and Instagram with like addictive um, algorithms and rewarding negative engagement. And it's like it's just ah, it's such a shame. Such a shame. Thank you, Assassin Hard. Ooh, Master Ball. Master Ball early, I'll do that. I, I think Elon's approach on making a change and see if it works and then reversing if it doesn't is, is actually pretty good. He's... He's just like, okay with the outrage it causes. And most companies aren't. You know, if like if if Twitch has to make a change, it's gonna have to take like months. How does subscribing to people work on Twitch? What's up, Kemi? Um, if you're new, if you follow the channel, that's basically like subscribing on YouTube. So you, it's like, you know when I'm live and all that. If you subscribe on Twitch, you're um, paying a monthly fee for lots of features like emotes and ad-free viewing. So that's basically your way you can support me, kind of similar to a Patreon. This cleared all of the, the rockets. So that's really nice. Thank you, Bash. Oh, surf. Nice. Chat, I, I've told this story before, but there I was at a I was at a town hall, Twitch town hall at PAX East 2015, eight years ago. Uh, and there was a Q&A session after their announcements of all new features and all that. And I went up to the microphone in front of all of these really high up Twitch staff and I was like, Hey, I have, I have an idea. It would be amazing if you could gift subscriptions to other users. Because I know a lot of people would do that. And then and the whole staff was like, oh, that's a pretty good idea. That's a pretty good idea. And then, bam, two and a half years later, we had gifted subs. So, it, it may have been me, you know. 
<laughs> it took so long. <laughs> it took so long for them to implement that. Chris wow, Chris wow, Chris wow, 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 wow. Hello cuties in chat and Chris, Chris sign. Thank you, Marcel. I am back. Two and a half years later. Thank me for gifted subs. Nah, I, I feel like it was it was going. You know, I wasn't the only one that wanted that. It's it's not like the craziest idea to think of, the most revolutionary idea, you know. But I mean, I don't know. Maybe I was the one that started the development on Twitch when I was suggesting it at that town hall. I could see that. Maybe I was the, you know, the spark. And the Twitch staff that was listening was like, yeah, we gotta do that. Badge and surf. I wonder of all the revenue Twitch is making, which percentage is gift subs alone? That has to be like a really significant portion. What floor is this? Three left side. was your vacation oh man it really it really wasn't the vacation but it, I had fun <laughs> I had a good time what's your gift to personal sub ratio you talking about partner plus stuff uh I have to think about that uh, Like the question you just asked? Oh, my revenue? From gift subs to other subs? Paid subs? Oh, uh, I think it's about 30%? 30% of all my subs are gift subs? Which is actually very low. I think most streamers have a higher ratio on that, like more gift subs than than paying subs. But that's good. That means you guys are, you know, that means this is like a really tight community. More, pe more people willing to contribute than just, you know, a few very, very well-off people gifting lots of subs. Thank you, Cold Chaos. Thank you for the five. It's healthy in the long run. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I'm, I'm happy with where we are Welcome and how it's going. To the crew. 
tight community Chris wow 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 oh wow Chris wow 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 w w w w w w good old w thank you tricky dog W W W W By the way, chat, new Pokemon album is almost done. Pokemon Chill Beats 2, I think will be the name. There's some 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 bangers on there. Um, I don't know when I'm gonna release it. Maybe... Well, I want to get it out as soon as possible. I can probably still get it out before the end of the year. Maybe in like a month or so. No vinyls, no. I I wouldn't I wouldn't sell anything physical that I don't fully own the rights to. It's it's a Pokemon composition, right? I I could get in trouble for that without licensing. But I could make a vinyl for Galaxy. <laughs> Galaxy and, uh, well, other original songs. I can't do Image. Image is actually a cover, if you think. It's a, it's a parody. It's a parody, actually. Par the, the, legal, uh, the legal stuff around parodies is a lot more lenient than covers. Image is a is a song from Hyper Potions. Well, the the composition is the music in in that I'm using is completely original. Teach surf of a bubble beam. Yeah, Viking. It's just with most most type of merch. Making just a few vinyls would be really expensive, but if you if you sell a lot, then the production is a lot cheaper. The way I would have to do it is I would have to basically make like a ton, like 50 or 100 at least. So it's not too expensive, like per sale. And then hope I hope I sell them. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't done any kind of merch stuff in a long time, actually. I have the merch store still open, but it's kind of meh. I think running like a merch campaign would be much nicer. Something exclusive. And something like that's not just, you know, a shirt.
pom 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 pom. I'm not a huge fan of printed shirts anymore because no matter how good the quality of the print, it's going to fade eventually. And that that bothers me. I like I like embroidery a lot. I think embroidery looks good and it's going to last way longer. So next time I'm getting out I'm getting merch out, I'm going to get some like cool embroidery design. On the on the shirts and hoodies and whatnot that lasts forever. No, not forever, but way longer. Marcel bought one of the the caps with the logo, the green only embroidery. That's a good one. It's good. It's a good hat. <laughs> What's up, Biscuit? Stream's going well, I think. That was risky. By the way, I just noticed something. Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> never mind, I'm dumb. I just realized I'm dumb. I was just in the dig house, right, in Kanto in Cerulean. And I was like, wait, we're playing we're playing Johto. Why are they they still haven't cleaned up from the robbery? But then I realized, wait a second, no. Kanto is still old, not new. Second floor is clear now. I'll check the tutor. Flamethrower? Flamethrower? Uh, maybe? Claire. Six, number six is six Pokemon guy. Which unlocks the basement key, which I don't need anymore. Never mind. I've already, I've already seen the basement key door. Basement key also works for new Marvel. Oh, nice. I mean, yeah, but the new Marvel key is super easy to get to. We already beat Norman, too. <coughs> oh, man. You guys ever fart and sneeze at the same time? 
definitely didn't happen just now. Oh, we got him. <laughs> There's so much pressure. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> no, no bash. Cannonball. We've talked about this before, chat. You ever... <laughs> you ever poop so hard that your back is wet? <laughs> Brother, <laughs> I call it the cannonball. Okay, 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 something more relatable, chat. Have you ever... You're sitting on the toilet, you're doing your thing, and you're fighting for your life, and you, you just take off your shirt because, you know, it's just too warm. Have you ever done it? Relatable. <laughs> I, 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 we've, oh, we, oh, yes, Betty. We had a whole conversation about this at GDQ a couple years ago, and we went to, like, literally everyone and asked them, hey, have you ever, have you ever taken off your shirt while pooping? And you'd be surprised how many people said yes. <laughs> Snarted, is that the is that the technical term? Term, I, I learned this one from Bird, or heard this one from Bird for the first time. <laughs> when you're, you're pooping, and you know you're not having a good time. He calls it fighting for his life, and I, I think that's such a funny term.
You can randomize the gym, I think. Water absorb Grumpick. Intimidate Kangaskhan. Damn. That would be so good. In Gen 3. There's another TM. Pursuit. Toilage. If, if a Groudon, not a Groudon, if a uh, ground type Rotom existed, chat, what would it be? What object? I was thinking a jackhammer, a drill, shovel. But shovel isn't, it, is, it needs to be something electric. An electric shovel, oh, okay. Yo, okay, fighting type. A punch machine. Is that really a dead end? That was Union Basement, GH. Lapras. The Mr. Meme revival, but with Rotom forms. Oh man, I think there might be more interest for stuff like that now. So we could do another Fiverr stream where we spend a couple hundred bucks on our like artists making um, Pokemon memes. Could go for like all of the Rotoms. Maybe. 
Could be fun. Yo, I mean, I'm, we're making a Rotom video already. Like the Rotom gauntlet challenge thing. If that does really well, then I'll follow it up with the fiber thing. Ghost type Rotom. What already is? A ghost type Rotom would be an electric masturbator. Because all of the dead children inside of it. <laughs> Come on, guys, that's not the craziest thing I've ever said. Or is it? <laughs> what if this PB is and you put it on YouTube? Well, then the people will know <laughs> what I've said. Good evening, Luco. How you doing? <laughs> no, what a waste of place kick. Dark type would be a taser. Dark type. A knife sharpener. Electric knife sharpener. Steel could be an iron. Oh, dude, that would be... Yeah. Steel would be super easy. Do you prefer baths or showers? That question is so harmless that I I'm sus. Like, why are you asking? <laughs> Human soup? No, I, I I usually I don't have a bathtub, so I just shower.
showers are probably preferred, but like a like a nice like an onsen or something can be nice. Yes. Did I did I beat Gen 1 Bruno? Yeah, I did. Thank you. Flying already exists. Poison could be some type of garbage disposal. Kind of like Garbador vibe. Yeah, what would dragon be? That's a, that's a complicated one.
did. Gate 15. Gate 15? No. And then I went in here. Well, I have no idea. to find Celadon March. Oh, by the way, we've gone through... 400 warps already. So fast. How does he do it? Which is more fun, GD, uh, TwitchCon or GDQ? It depends. It depends what you're looking for. As a viewer, Um, I would probably suggest GDQ more than TwitchCon. Well, if you like speedruns and all that. As a streamer, TwitchCon is probably better. Have you given autographs, Chris? Yes, I have. If people want me to sign something, I'll do it. Usually. Very famous, yes. I don't charge, no.
I went to I went to the a meet and greet at EGX for like a bunch of streamers. And I finished talking to one of them and went on to the next one and he goes like, "Want me to sign your asshole?" <laughs> I'm like, "Let's go, dude." <laughs> At least he asked for you, right? <laughs> oh my god, Gary, no. Damn it, Gary. Ah, uh, it's a far zone. Uh, I don't think we need the zone anymore, do we? Maybe for strength. Oh, well, I want to do this. I'm looking for ex speciales, por favor. No. I was just here. Potion man? Potion man. Take me by the hand. Take me to the way. Can't go this way. No, that wasn't the tea guard. That was the bike guard for the uh, cycling road. <laughs> Four guards, one cop. <laughs> That's a good one.
There you go. The bike. Leaf blade. Hello. French bike. Wait a second. I have to. There was another funny thing. What was that? Oh, dude, Gary's quote was pretty funny too. But we don't have we don't have Alex's emotes on our bot. So maybe we can change it to the emojis instead. Yeah, like that's Caitlyn. Multitasking.
Da -da -da -da. What do you think about the bike song in Gen 1? Because that song is gonna be part of the new album. Oh, is it double M? Oh, I found it. Waterstone, Firestorm. PB able seed or too early to tell? It's a good pace. I don't I think it's too early to tell though. Looking like a really good run so far. Oh, smelling salt. No. We're looking for X specials. No, where are the X specials? Oh my god, are they actually just nowhere? They have to be somewhere. Oh, there you go. Are you heading to Australia this Thursday? I think I will, yeah. It's gonna be exciting. Looking forward to it. puzzle too powerful dude stop what are these misinputs Falling for the basement, ladies. We're down bad. We lost because of Blissey. The miss is on 85% accurate moves, man. Only one foot. This lives, I think. Oh god, easily. Crit. Not me. Drill pack Gyarados? 
Hello? Rock Blast. He's gonna heal. Oh my god, dude. The butterfly's edging us. Missed. I'm gonna kill me. Double miss, man. Doing so little damage, man. Do I have a full restore? I don't think I do. Crit! No! No full restore. Toughest fight in the game so far. Juan. Welcome to the group. Gracias, at isotherm. Poor eagle arm unit subscription. Chris, you will. Thanks for sharing your Risa Puffy. Guess it was a gift sub from isotherm though. Water absorb sun current. Was that five, six, seven, eight, nine badges so far? Tomorrow we're continuing Kaizo Mario Sunshine.
The game is really difficult. It's like insanity difficult. It's so difficult that one of the best Sunshine players... He only had, what, had like 20 shines? I think Trey had 20 shines after 30 hours of playing. That's insane. I, I have 10 shines so far, and I played for... 6 hours. I'm looking forward to it though. I mean, it obviously it was frustrating to play last uh, last Monday, but I still like had a good time overall. Very satisfying when you make progress, and with safe states, it's not too, it's not too bad. Although there's some shines that even with safe states took me like over an hour. We find Morty's gym, we can beat him right away. Understandable panic. It was very grindy. How do I? Oh, God. How do I beat Dragonite? Rolling kicks. Sleepy early today, Shannon. No! He turned. He got me. I have a like, couple Lepa berries. Should be fine. Maybe an elixir? Would you eat a hamburger shaped like a boop? Yes. Of course. Who wouldn't? I would eat a boop shaped like a hamburger.
That crit may have mattered? I don't know. I should heal. Can we find a Pokemon Center, please? Game? No? To Lily Cove, okay. Acceptable. We don't need this. What's going on? Actually, hold on. Uh, Dushmo, thank you very much for resubscribing for the 19. Thank you. Did I not get auto modded? Was it a bad image? I can't really see. Oh, I think it's Booba. I, I can see. Booba. Poggies. <laughs> I know Poggies from uh, Cherno's stream. Up snaky drips. I'm doing pretty good, yeah. No, I was doing good. Okay. in the mart.
Lugia, but our main's already so good. I don't think I need to check the uh, road f 104. Better than crying while waking up, Bash, right? Oh, this is good. We're getting strength here. Jump kick! Yes, that's so much better. Raise with Shen, first to encounter the cable car hiker wins. <laughs> that is so dumb. E4 Koga, Rustboro, Olivine. Oh, Rustboro's done. No! Basement key that I didn't get, but can still get. Three hundred thirty-one warps to go. Pace. 
I mean, warps per minute or per hour checks are like, I'm, I'm doing insanely well this time. I, it doesn't really mean all that much, though. I don't have fly. I've beaten 64. It was pretty good. Forty-six. That's bad. Ah, oh, you can't go that way. That sucks. Invisible sprite. Yoxis. Okay, I'll get the basement key now. Oh my god, stop. Oh my god, stop. Let's not do that four times in a row. Fairy master. So we've seen it all. Ah, uh, let's go over here. <sighs> Every time, man. With how complicated these map rando categories are starting to get, how long until we add Gen 4? Well, I can't make that happen, but someone knowledgeable with programming could. I don't, I don't think the category is too long. Like, f five and a half hours on your own is totally fine. I think anything over eight hours is when it gets really bad.
I, I'm, I mean, if I if I did a one through nine one, I would probably turn it into some type of multi-day stream. Not all in one sitting. Where do we go? Huh? That's wrong? Oh, this is completely wrong. Oh, I think this is where that crash happened. I'm gonna have to fix these markings. Oh, bro, no, I'm stupid. This is... Crap, what did that just say? I overwrote it. This is a different room. It's that Jagged Pass? Oh yeah, thank you so much. It was Jagged Pass, it was Jagged Pass. Don't mind me, Chad. I'm a little sleepy today. But I'm still gonna PB this run. That's bad. Don't like that. He's losing it. Maybe. I might be losing it a little bit. Shockwave could be good. I'd rather have an ice move though, I think. For Dragonite. And other dragons. Oh, I said this earlier. Does anyone here play Pokemon trading card game online? I got I got these free codes like packs. It's like I don't know, like 10 of them in there. If you if you want some like free cards, I can I can just like give you give you the codes. There was a shop at EGX that was just giving them out for free. then I'll keep I'll hold on to them for a bit these online codes for like packs they're for like old cards right like they're for, from whatever box they're from originally so these are gonna be like random and probably outdated But you can like, can't you like, trade them?
No, not trade the codes, but trade... Or like, get currency for cards by trashing them or something, and then you can buy cards or something. I don't know how it works. I thought there was something similar to that. You get currency for duplicates. Well, that's good then, yeah. I used to play the TCG Online too. I built a deck where I forced my opponent to run out of cards. People hate that. I was toxic scum online. TCG Online is dead. TCG Live is now the app to use. Is it? It's still the same idea, though, right? Welcome to the crew. One and a half years, Chris Pock. Thank you, Zuppy. Thank you for resubscribing. Still no fly. What's new? Oh wait, well fly we can get, but we know fly badge. And I do have strength. Yeah, I'm not Yo, Kaiser, thank you. Chris Lick. Thank you for the tier two. We stopped. Man, I really want to do the archipelago thing with Chen. But I feel like I have every day of the, ne the next week already figured out. And on the weekend, I'm playing Wonder. So I was going to have to wait until like next, next week. But then we do the double Pokemon archipelago. It's going to be great. True co-op. 
like full item random. No Shen this week. Did he say that he's gone too, or is it because of what I said? Well, yeah, probably no Shen this week. <laughs> We're playing games with Bloody on Wednesday. Yes, of course, Marcel. It's a main Mario game. That's what I do. I'm the guy. I'm the Mario guy. And well, I guess lately I've been more of the Pokemon guy, not the Mario guy. But I'm the guy. I do the thing. I was the Pikmin guy for a little bit in between. And the Clubhouse Gamer guy. Clubhouse Games arc was uh, one of the highlights of my career, to be honest. Have you seen the, the relay cunts? get a cl clubhouse sequel arc <laughs> I, I'll, I'll get it's definitely it's high up on the list of things I'll get back into eventually <laughs> I want to run that game again Turn to the club hose. I like Clubhouse games so much. It's such a... It's so... It's like nostalgic for everyone. Even though it's not even video game related. And then... You know, my, 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 my YouTube channel has been like mostly Pokemon lately. And I made that one Clubhouse games video. And it like did really well too. Which made me happy. Like, 
Hell yeah, people want to see Clubhouse games. And, and then actually my, my previous Clubhouse games videos, like I uploaded my PBs back when I was like doing less effort YouTube. And they, they all did really well too. It was a huge surprise. Lots of interest. Cherry Grove was done too. I'm just gonna dig out. To Little Root. done too. Uh oh. We're it's starting to matter that we don't have fly. I'm losing a bunch of time traveling, like uh naving. So typical, dude. So typical. Port is done, Violet's done, Celadon is done, Goldenrod store. Oh, but it's, it's the basement. This doesn't work. What about Verdant Turf? Verdant Turf. Ah, there's two question marks. I should do this. From your experience, it's pretty easy to update the Archipelagio once new games are added, or is it a pain? Oh, I've never up I've never updated. I've just been using what what they gave me. The whole setup is a pain though, I think, regardless. It's it's honestly very intimidating. But once Emerald is in, it's not going to be big of a, a big a big change. You basically just have to copy you have to download a folder and paste it in one of the archipelago folders and then do your settings as usual. Like, if you've already done Archipelago, you're probably, you're fine. Huh. 
Hi, hey, Queen. Queens. So I'm thinking of setting you up the or cheap wedgeo, but I'm also thinking about waiting you to remove gets out of beta and his few is outed. Fwim UW experience is a quick easy to you update the or keep wedgeo once new games or Dude, how is it six degrees out? When I left the city two days ago to leave the country, it was 20 degrees. How is it six degrees now? Eggs Blaine. Suddenly winter? Climate change. Not the climate. Did I punch Harry? I didn't punch him, no. I mounted him. Like a horse. No. More like a... Baby koala. But yeah, we hung out uh, at the... We we were invited to some after party from TikTok. It was like a gaming bar. It was really sick, actually. They had a bunch of setups with switches. And you, you can just play the games there and buy drinks. Except the drinks were free, actually. It was nice. Sick atmosphere. We played some Mario Kart, some Mario Party, Tetris. All kinds of things. Oh, the rockets are gone. Oh, because I beat Master Ball? I think. Oh my god, good luck with the, with the PC, Kitsune. I still need to do surgery on my computer and install that new uh, graphics card. But I'm lazy. Skirt. Sixteen, we've been in the round sixteen. Let's go to the Mirage Tower. 
I can actually leave here. Hoshi? Maybe? No. But maybe. <laughs> maybe. If it's ever a thing. Do I have a strength patch? I do. I do. Ooh, arrow blast. What else? Bulk up. Oh, we don't need that. When is the new Luigi's Mansion coming out? Or Luigi's Mansion 2 coming out again? What's the what's the release date for that? It's next summer. Oh. Why so late? It's just a remake, brother. Luigi's Mansion 2. 2. Is it called Luigi's Mansion 2? HD, I think was the name. Is it the same name in, in America? Or did they call it Dark Moon HD? They dropped the Dark Moon, yeah. <gasps> That's a fly badge, and I can actually get it, and then we just have to nav back to Fort Tree and we got fly. Dude, this is our actually a like, really good run, I would say. Nana dopamine storm badge. Is it dopamine? Yes, it is. Which cities have we not been to yet? No. Signwood? Azalea? Mm. That might, might be it. Oh, I could get to both. Well, I could get to one of them by surfing. Lazy command. Yep. It was the big sky noodle. Tried my first soul link randomizer yesterday, Chris Pock. My balls, McNuts. Thank you for the prime. What? So, what does? How does soul link ex like work exactly? I keep seeing that term, but I'm not quite sure if I know what it is.
and not yeah yeah and I'm I'm aware it's some type of nuzlocke, like a two-player nuzlocke, but. What, whatever they catch on one route is connected, and if one person dies, so does the other. Okay, but like, if I catch a Rattata, does my partner also get a Rattata? Or like, how does that work? Saffron City and Big Hub are good. Saffron City, Big Hub. Your first encounter and their first encounter, different Pokemon most always. And then we both get both, or how? Route 1 catches are linked. That was a crit, damn. I'm out of revives and I didn't save. Oh, you just check which Pokemon are linked. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. No. No, dude, the accuracy on this thing. Trying to make sure I, to get the one shot with water spout, so I'm lowering it with rock blast. Okay. I'm going full HP now, then we're gonna use water spout and hope it goes down. At plus three, dude. Surely that's strong enough. Butterfree saves the day.
That strength we already have. <laughs> I save every now and then. The game auto saves too. We got technology, dude. What's up, Dahlia? How you doing? What? Come on. I'll just do this. I saw a Senta over there. I'm a little desperate. Also, I think Silco Floor 3 was good for Fly. What is auto crafting? Sounds interesting. Yeah. I don't know, Demio. Just forgetful. You give it items and it will craft it for you. So, you isn't that just like the recipe book? Oh, wait, I'm confused. to the hub and from the hub we go to lighthouse top oh my god please fine give me your ball and we can deliver the potion
And Fortree for Fly. Three hours and ten minutes in, Fly. Pretty good. <laughs> Nah, it's I think I would I would say that's probably a little below average. Better than Pokemon Minecraft SM64. And that is true, that's true. I thought you were hating on the combo for a second, and I was uh concerned. Concerned. I think that's an emote. Harry told me, chat, that he doesn't like the three-game multi-world rando. And I'm like, understandable. It's not for everyone. I liked it, you know. I'm actually pretty pumped to play more. It's exciting. It's new. Exciting. You know? I get to I get to play Pokemon. Or I get to tell people I play Pokemon and then sneak in some Mario Wahoo. And a little bit of Minecraft. Minecraft's fun too. I'm so bad at it though. I know so- Oh my god, we're known as you too. We could have had the combo just staying in Fortree. That's a good Albert quote. That's a Clubhouse Games quote right there. We're just talking about White eyes with her. Hello, Micromads. Chat, I met Micromads at EGX and I got an autograph. I can show you. Wait, I want to see it. That's obvious. She signed one of my Surskid Pokemon cards. Look at that. And she gave she gave it a top hat. It was cute. A Surskid with a hat. Gamer Champ? Gamer Champ? 
I don't know who you are. But I like it. <laughs> that's a that's a good idea. Oh, I've seen this one and I wanna stay there. Card key question mark. It was number seven. It was number seven. To Fortune. To the March. To the March. To. Yeah. Yeah, that's an interesting idea. It would definitely add more variety. It would make it slower overall because you would have you would be forced to do unoptimal plays. But I mean if it's more fun, I don't care. You know. Anything to make it more enjoyable. I do kind of like the freedom, though, of being able to change game whenever. What if I add more games? And then we spin a wheel every 10 minutes. <laughs> and that's the game I have to continue. Now that's entertainment right there. Chris, in this infinite abyss of strawberry scented piss, wouldn't it be a bliss to call it quits and start a business with the good old Swiss? Don't you dare to dismiss and begin to reminisce about the wonderful kiss with the 100 years old Calliophis. Welcome to the crew. Thank you, Penny. Spin that wheel, Chris. Wow, Chris. Wow. Ah, uh, Christian, thank you for the prize. Chris Grin. Flamethrower. Oh my god. That's the move, guys. That's the move. I should teach that while I'm in horn. Also, I'm looking for an ice move, but I don't have any. Oh, Isotherm with 200 bits. Yes, thank you. Thank you.
Is this also a Nuzlocke? No. It says speedrun. A randomizer speedrun. We're three hours, 20 minutes in. I got... I mean, I would like to finish in the next two hours, so it's like a decent PB. We're missing... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Badges. At least one E4 and one champion. So what does that mean? What does that mean for us? I'm not sure. Pays good? Who knows? Well, oh, I'm missing. I'm missing lands too. Gh. Gen one lands. E four lands. So 2e4, Indigo Plateau. Hello, Anton. How are you doing? What games will you play at GDQ? Bravo Punk. I feel like you already know, but you want me to say it for everyone else. Tell me if I'm right. If not, I mean, I'm going to say it anyway. I said it at the beginning of the stream. GDQ has accepted Shen and I for a full item randomizer showcase. So we'll actually get to play full item rando co-op. You know, the category we use, we play a lot. Potentially in front of over 100,000 people at the same time. That's pretty hype.
Do you think GDQ would accept the Panty Party speedrun? Or is Panty too NSFW? It's just Panty. The game, the game is very safe for work. It's literally, it's literally like on the Nintendo eShop as well. It's just the name. What? What kind of double bat is this? Panties, 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 panties. I feel like I'm profiting of bullying right here. Welcome to the crew. Ride on D's. What is it, Gary? God damn it, man. These panties. Why did I ask? Disgusting. No, they do not cause it. <laughs> don't, don't do it. Clean to you now. I don't think so, Panic. I have to shout it to him. Uh, 
I gotta maybe send him a timestamp or something or a clip from the video. Floor nine. Pewter. Did you guys see any crazy streams that happened at the end of like September when like the gift subs were like discounted? I feel like I didn't really pay attention much to it. I was just doing my own thing. I don't think my stream was that crazy. I was just matching. I did, I did see, was it dangerous? I don't, I don't remember, but someone, someone had like 6,000 subs or whatever, <laughs> out of nowhere. No, don't, 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 don't Gary. What's going on? When you don't even start your sentence like that. Wow. Marts, thank you. Marcel, gifting stuff to the community. That would be a funny quote as well. It's gonna be, okay, I might get banned for saying this, but, and then quote, banned user 2023. Anonymous gifting us up to fluffy pants. Thank you very much. It was, it was Adonis. Panic, thank you for gifting a tier two sub to the community. And we got a hype train going. Second or third one today, actually. It's like supposed to be a conductor head, but the the design on this thing, there's like a, I think it's more like a sailor head because there's an anchor icon on one of the buttons. A symbol, not icon.
No! Wrong turn. You need the Thomas the Tank Engine glasses. <laughs> Is it just his face twice or what? Dude, I actually I don't remember anything about the show, but I do remember watching Thomas when I was when I was like, I don't know, six years old. Six, seven. However old I was. Good time. That show creeped me out. Yeah. Man, the, the faces in like kids shows, they're they're terrifying. Very creepy. Have a look. The hell. <laughs> they're really dumb. Interesting. You know, the creepiest cartoon character from, like, kids' shows? Caillou. What's wrong with him? Why is he bald? you grew up to be a serial killer I'd believe it Can we watch Party Caillou? No. no. Flying, uh, Mosty has probably more. Uh, J Rod denied. Welcome to the stream. The reason, the reason, it's quite obvious. This horrible graffiti is to blame. Behold the sketch of the perpetrator based on eyewitness descriptions. The truth is obvious. The guilty party sits among us. It is none other than Mario. Mario. Dude, the intro, the sunshine intro is just burned into my brain.
You have no idea how many times I listened to it. The panty, thank you, um, for Marcel. I've been to Azalea, I can go there. Ah. Welcome to the crew. Dark fire. Thank you for the prompt. The SS ticket? I don't think I need this anymore. I, I don't need this anymore. I've done all the SS ticket checks already. Thank you for giving us up to Pokemon. Gary? We don't want to lose you. The hell was that cry? It sounded like... It sounded like that pufferfish eating a carrot. <laughs> That's what it's not like. Azalea! Azalea, by the way. The song that is gonna be part of the next album. I've seen this. I've seen this. I marked it as a surf thing. I'm just gonna dead end it because I've seen it. Uh, let's go to. One hundred fifty uh, warps to go. Dang, we're missing a ton of gems. I 
I don't like this. Oh, Ecritique was done. What's the difference between a dead baby and an apple? I don't fuck an apple before I eat it. What? 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 I thought Gary was cool. I'm sorry, Gary. Actually, I'm not sorry. I don't care that much. You thought Gary was cool? Well, he was funny earlier, and then it just got—it just got worse. Round eleven. Don't worry, he's gone. That was quite the 1,000 bit investment. Yeah. Hey, at least you can't refund bits. <laughs> got to see the positives <laughs> What's up party boy Actually running out of easy question mark checks. No. Take a drink every time I forget to repel. Uh, 
Ah, this floor is new. Keep going here. Oh, this floor is great. We'll definitely... You see those five question marks on the floor we're on? If one of them is a gym, or I gift a sub to the community. <laughs> Big spender today, I know. Chris Pace rent for chat in gift subs, of course. What is, what is this sound? Like it's like some type of arrow sound. You hear that? Olivine has a bunch more. It's okay, Marcus. You've been <laughs> very supportive. Check the last. We'll go back. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's easy to get to from Saffron. I ate big before stream too. Why am I so hungry? Why am I so hungry? I might have to order food. I'm not sure. Not sure what I left in my fridge before I left uh, to the UK. You want beans for breakfast? I had beans for breakfast. It was pretty good. What's wrong with beans for breakfast?
When you went to Japan, what did you do for breakfast? I went to 7-Eleven and I got a maple infused pancake. Most of the time. And a coffee. But also... There's like some bento stuff that's really nice. Like some rice and... Like a like an onigiri or something. What is better, English breakfast or American breakfast? I think that both are equally gross. <laughs> I think eating sausage for breakfast is so weird. I think, in general, I don't like... I don't really... I'm not a huge fan of savory foods for breakfast. That's just me, though. For the longest time, I thought meat for breakfast, in general, is extremely odd. Chris Meyer. Where do I go? Celadon City. Thank you, Majin. I've had it. I've had it, Marcel. It's nice. See, I think beer for breakfast is not weird. But meat, kind of weird. Oh, we've been here. My my bre I like like pastries for breakfast and like sweet stuff. And if I if I do eat bread for breakfast, I like to put I don't know peanut butter on it or like Nutella. I it, I can't do cheese for breakfast. That's that's nasty. Cheese for breakfast or sausage. I don't know, man. But uh, I've gotten more used to like having the the more popular breakfast options. Uh, like with like hash browns. Hash browns are awesome. Any any kind of like. Potato for breakfast is really nice. Um, I do, I do enjoy like a, a piece or two of bacon, but it's easily overdone. Bacon is extremely overrated. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, mate. Like a... Like pretzel for breakfast. Like a... Pretzel with butter and some, like, herbs for breakfast. That's nice. Or like a... 
poisson. Or... I don't know, like a bagel with a nice spread, like a... Oh, when I we went to like, was it Einstein's? The bagel place? My go-to is like the poppy seed bagel with honey almond spread. It's nice. Honey? Honey's great. The time of the day does not matter for breakfast. Breakfast is the first meal after sleep. It's when you break the fast. Legally speaking. in Johto? Oh yeah, right, all of mine. Some restaurants only serve breakfast menu early. Yeah, I hate it. It's dumb. Also, America... Just make it makes up their own rules when it comes to breakfast food. Deep fried breaded steak. Call it a breakfast. Like what? Oh, I think I owe you guys a sub.
Beans. Beans for breakfast. It's it's so smart. It's just so smart. Ooh, cerulean looks good. Sparkman 69. Oh. Pancakes and waffles any day. I'm just hungry, man. <laughs> Dude, you know what you should try is actually like so good for breakfast. Try like a miso soup for breakfast. Miso soup. Um It's so it's so comforting. Miso soup, and then if you need, obviously that wouldn't fill you up very much. You would, you would have to have it with some, I don't know, some rice or some like very soft tofu in it. That'd be nice. Ginger in miso soup is not uh, usual, yeah. But I could see it being nice, yeah. Deep fried butter stick. Hell yeah, brother. Inject butter into my veins. Two shots of vodka worth of butter, please. There is this drug that it's like a celebrity drug that they use for weight loss and it's like really expensive and they're testing it currently because it, it's actually like really 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 helpful yeah yeah it's really helpful for people like that are severely obese uh, not everyone that's obese obviously it's not always their fault there's like eating disorders mental health 
And then sometimes it's even like phys a physical thing you have no control over. And for those people, it's like amazing. But like, what if they actually just release it and let everyone have it? Like, and they fund it and they make sure people lose weight. It was like an interesting... I, I, I was watching a video that was talking about this and it's like, it's, it's very interesting. Because, um... Investing that all that money into making it easier for people to lose weight, even if it's kind of a cheat code. Um, but it would still improve their health. Because obesity is linked to so many diseases. There's a correlation between poverty and obesity. Yeah, because a lot of the junk food is super cheap and it's, it's high calorie. That's why I'm saying it's not it's not always like the person's fault in America specific. Yeah, tones. It would definitely have to be regulated still until they know more about the effects. You know, they could also invest into just other stuff that is healthier and reduces obesity. Like having more walkable neighborhoods. And... You know, healthier food options that aren't expensive. Pipe dreams. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> this is like futuristic. If if it'll ever happen, who knows? Chat, I'm so excited. America, I'm, I'm, if you're listening, <laughs> Americans, I'm so sorry, but I'm very excited for the presidential elections next year. It's going to be so much fun. <laughs> uh, it's just going to be so exciting, man. It's, it's like, it's like uh, my favorite show is getting a new season. <laughs> It's gonna be, it's gonna be bad. Imagine though. Wait, okay, so I have a question. Uh, they do presidential debates on like several outlets, right? It's That's like super standard and normal. But they, they don't really allow Trump to be on television anymore. On, not on every channel, right? 
So how does how does that work then? He just chooses not to. Oh, they would still show him. Damn. Okay, okay. okay. There's no way he's winning. No. No, no, no. It's- I think it's different this time. I think it's way worse this time. Because... Their own party is, like, divided. That never happens. On the right. Oh, I've been here. That is very true, but Rose do not care. Oh, okay. I have another question then. I, this is just interesting to me. Uh, so he, he was, he was, he's very confident he's gonna become the Republican nominee, right? So how does that work, though? Uh, what if is there like a vote within the party or something? Who gets to be the one? Oh, okay. And there, and that is, is that, is that just like simple majority or something? Because then he's, then, yeah, he can definitely be the nominee. I can definitely see that happen. And then, I mean, and then worst case for him, if if he wouldn't be the nominee, he would just run as an independent, right? Which would be good for the left. puzzle. Uh, I have flash. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I brought it up, chat. We can talk about something else. It's just interesting. Where's the 
Ash. Catch up on pasta, yes, no. No. I don't even have ketchup in my house. Mustard, though. Mmm. Dude, I'm weird with mustard. I love mustard so much. I put it on, like, just, like, toast. And then eat it plain. Just toast and mustard. Love mustard. We're at 76 warps left. Olive vine is good. Oh, Lily Cove store. I was just there. Floor five. I love mustard, dude. <laughs> hey, what's the most German thing about me, chat? What do you think? You're not funny. <laughs> so funny. My name? Rhythm to fuck. No. There is a lot of uh, Chris's in Germany, yeah. It's a very common name. Punctuality. I love being punctual. Is there a stereotype about Americans not being punctual? Or am I just too punctual and annoyed that the, my American friends aren't punctual? Chen is just one of them. <laughs> Where's Hoenn? Ah, dude, holds. Self call through Signwood or any self call. Any. Any self call, please. Literally, just fly somewhere, and self call is gonna be there. 
I lied. Where's self go? Fall, fall over, fall over. There you go. Three gems to go? I did beat Jimona. Jimona wins, yes. Steep's great. My audio died. Cool. Musty. Duford. Musty. Duford. Saladon. Two item. A uh, two and Saladon. Man, this this glitch is so weird. Has anyone ever heard this before? It's like my uh, I go. It always happens when I go through a loading. And it just could be complete coincidence, but it feels like it always happens when my PC does some type of load. It happened with this emulator, which runs on a browser, by the way, and then it also happens on MGBA sometimes. I'm not sure if noticed it with any other game. And then uh, my audio is just completely silent. And then, now it's back. It just came back out of nowhere. Like what? What's what's going on? And you guys can hear it fine by the way. It's just I just can't hear it. It's so weird. Not my ears. It sounds like a sound driver reload or something. Oh, maybe it's like it needs a little bit to start back up. Because it, it usually fixes itself within, I don't know, two or three minutes. And it happens like once a day. It happened once during the bloody thing and once 
when we raced small and and then today just now for like the, the today was a short one it was like a minute I'm pretty sure I've checked this one already. Ah, this was the one I undid. Because I'm stupid. I can do that. When's carpetless? Bro, no. no. I saw a clip of Simply from 2019 the other day where the first person to, like, the first person to ever do carpetless uh, pulled it off. And, you know, it obviously, it spread through the community. And Simply was so mad, oh my god, because his entire chat, like he was already a big streamer then, his entire chat was just talking about Carpetless. So he started freestyle rapping and singing, Carpetless, Carpetless, Carpetless. What are you doing Carpetless, what are you doing Carpetless? I said some cities and I already forgot. Cool. Pewter City. Can someone write these down, please? Pewter, Vermilion. Punky pulled it off. First one to do it on a on a decent run. Cool. <laughs> I I hate carpetless just as much as everyone else. I was just teasing everyone back then. I re I remember I said it in in a very long time ago. I was like, oh, maybe one day, maybe one day. Carpetless is gonna be RTA viable. And people made fun of me online. They were like, Chrism? Hate that guy. Why would he say that? Now everyone's talking about it in my chat's ass. And now they're doing it. Oh, I've seen this one. Uh, can you add to the list? Uh, Violet City?
Self call. How's this not open yet? What? Uh, Moss Deep, Pacific Lock, Olivine. Duford, Lily Cove. Okay, that's gonna be a good list for checks. A little bit of everything. Actually, no Kanto cities. I feel really tired today, too. The conversations have been kind of nice today. Right? Up and down, you know. Keeping me entertained and awake. Okay, I said Pacific Lock. You can take Pacific Lock off the list. And Lily Cove. Take Duford off the list too. Welcome to the crew. Blazing Dolly, thank you. Thank you very much. Surf Circle? Yes. Uh, Violet Olivine, okay.
Oh, Lilikov back on the list. That, that I actually forgot the one that I wrote down initially. These are both Tojo. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that's this one. Oh. That's cut. We don't need that anymore. And then I said olivine. The waterfall checks are both Tojo sites, so I don't need it. I need to. I don't need to check that. That's a dead end. I said Lily Cove because of abandoned ship. I think yes, this one. Ah, I don't think I can beat the... Yeah, there's no way I can beat the co-op PV solo. Which, I mean, would be a big task. But I can, I'm still on a really good pace, I would say, overall. For a solo PV. Violet, Olive, and Lilico. I did it all now. This doesn't exist. Goldenrod City is really good. Burke City is good. I hope I'm not getting sick. But if I if I did get sick, it would actually be a good time now. I don't have any plans to like leave. <laughs> I'll be at home for a while now. I sound a bit congested. Yeah, maybe a little bit.
Oh, yeah. That was the one. Burden to of Golden Rod. Uh, how do I get there? SSN. Falarber. Lava Ridge. Falarber, Lava Ridge. Falarber. Two. Make me go to Route 25, that would suck. Oh man, there's this one mansion check I can do. I have to talk to one of the statues first though. Sutopolis gym I can do. Oh, Lavender! Lavender is good. Lavender has one free one. And then Viridian as well, yeah. Lavender and Viridian. That's nothing. Lavender and Viridian. Final stretch. Are you still doing that? Dude, come on. I found a flute in another game, yeah? A blue flute. Teachy TV, let's go, dude. And that's right alone. You said two easy ones by Violet. Oh, that's not the right region, though. Fuchsia. No, Cinnabon. Silf call. Through. Saffron. Mm -hmm. 
Oh my god, of course it's Diglett's cave. I still haven't checked the fossil stuff from Mount Moon either. Oh, okay, that's the one I was just talking about. Silco Floor 4? Missing four loading zones. And we only have 13 question marks left. How? 12. Ah, uh, don't know. Actually, this isn't too bad, right? From this side, it's not too bad. New bark. New new bark. Little new bark. Old tail. Sorry. New bark. Old tail. Lava ridge. And silk again. Back to self call floor five. So, what was it New Bark? Old red, uh, old, yeah, lava ridge. New old lava, cool. New old lava. Got it, got it, got it. Can't do this one yet. That's good though. That's a new discovery. All the vines really good too. All the vines. I'm going. I'm going to old tail now though. Oh, actually, I can't. I can't do the lava ridge one. I don't have the goggles. I'd have to go through the store instead. A new discovery! Wonderful. I miss Pokemon, new Pokemon Snap. I hope they make another one. Oh man, I haven't even thought about this in so long. Another Pokemon Snap would be so good.
10 checks left, 3 gems to find is really unlucky. What is that boulder check? That's that's the slow poke one. Slow poke one. New. Let's go to new. 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 Wait, Phoebe's on floor four. What's Swampert's signature move? Because Blaziken's blaze kick was so bad. Muddy water? That's so bad too. My god. Sceptile definitely won that one. Leaf Blade is amazing. Although, what's the power of Leaf Blade in this, in Gen 3? I think they buffed it at some point. Intruders! Ah, uh, Leaf Blade was only 70 power. Yeah, so they all kind of sucked actually. What's so special about Blaze Kick? Like, is there any? Is it like higher burn chance than Flamethrower? Like, why would you consider Blaze Kick over Flamethrower in Gen Three? I don't think it's high crit rate. Oh, it is. I never knew that. Never do.
Okay, that's a gym. Dude, they might be both gyms. That would be so lame. Dessert checks? Hmm. Chat, what's your go-to dessert you would order at a restaurant? For me? Chocolate mousse? Or like a Chocolate cake. Although, lava cake, man. I feel like they mess it up so often. Cheesecake. Cheesecake's good. Rhubarb crumble. Oh, damn it. I shouldn't have said it. That sounds so good. They're both gyms. Dude, hello? Second to last can I checked. Crumble cake is good. Very good. Oh, a, like a creme brulee. That's really nice too. I need help. So little left. I have to get to Lily Cove store or fly. So if I'm in Hoenn, I fly to Lava Ridge. If I'm in Johto, I can go to Cyanwood. Okay, so sign wood.
for leak of store. For this Mirage Tower? Yeah. On first floor. I don't know. I, I what's my PB? I don't have. I don't have. I can see right now. It's like five forty something. I think five forty one. Yeah, I mean, sh should still be able to do. this one blackthorn blackthorn and this one is okay too Thorn, Cherry Grove. That's the only thing I can find right now. Goldenrod Store. I think this is not even a trainer fight required. Yeah. Could be wrong. Oh no, it is. Is that it? Wait, are we done? Oh, we're done. That was it. Oh, let's go. <laughs> it's over, dude. <laughs> Should be PB pace. Sub 530, maybe? I think I'll beat the time I got with small end. <laughs> Let's go, dude.
Cherry Grove, Moss Deep. Cherry Grove, Moss Deep. And Silphco. Cherry Grove, Moss Deep, Silphco. Cherry Grove, Moss Deep, Silphco. I'll just mute it now. All right. Four fights to go. Oh, wait, I still have to beat Glacia. The TikTok lounge guy. Yeah, I was lounging so hard, dude. They had free cookies. How could I not? Sound of silence, only for this fight. There was free cookies. Could have gotten you some. Vibe off. If you're vibing, turn it off. Crab Rave? Should I put on Crab Rave? No. Okay. Yeah, I'm dying, Michael. <laughs> Mish. I'm tired. Hey, Vsauce. Michael. Alright. Now we're in Johto, and I said Blackthorn? Did I say Blackthorn? No, Cherry Grove, Cherry Grove. Cherry Wolf. <laughs> uh, it's a scary song. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Ah! Okay. okay, this song too, but then we're good. We're, we're good after this one. No, don't do that. Do I have a cherry berry? Heal me. No. Oh, a lumberry. I have like no potions either, but I, I'm, 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 I might not eat them. Well, maybe for the final, final boss. Wait, Indigo Plateau was right there, man. I could have gone. Oh, well. Cordon.
All right, that's this one. And the prediction is going to end soon. For how many times will red show us? And then this was Kanto, so we'll be in Pellet. From Pellet, or from Kanto, how do I get to Sylph very easily? Wait, no. I have to beat Glacier. I forgot. Goldenrod City. No. Yes. Goldenrod City. We have to go to floor five. Go to floor five. And then we go back to Sylph. On the same floor. Just set up again. That's pretty optimal then, doing Glacier this late actually. Naving. I'm naving. I'm naving. He's naving. Alright. And the next fight is the prediction one. Not this one. But we can pretend. Oh my god. Alright, we're starting with bug. One. Rehearsal. It's prediction rehearsal, guys. Three.
I lost count. <laughs> five? F five? Six? Eight? Dude, I don't know. Terrible, terrible, terrible rehearsal. I need to go back to school? No, I need some sleep. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> Maybe doing this mega run today was a bad idea. <laughs> uh, can I, I might be able to get sub 530. Slate port. Uh, Slate port city. Uh, Viridian. Slate port Viridian's good. I can't go out here. That's not an exit. Okay. Slate port or Viridian. Slate port or Viridian. Oh, come on. I didn't buy potions. What can go wrong? Two, I have only two minutes. Two and a half to get sub, sub 5.30, dude. We gotta risk it. Alright, one. Oh, maybe that was too much setup. Three, normal psychic guys. Fire. That outspent me, that's very scary. How? No, I have so much EV.
drizzle. Six. Is that actually eight? With one Pokemon left. Grass flying. Nine total. And time, dude. Sub 530. Like and subscribe. Let's go. PB. Nice. 12 minute PB with five loading zones remaining. Not bad. I mean, the seat was bad. Dude, if I get a good seat, I could probably get sub five, man. I can...